Now, if you want to install Windows XP on your Macintosh, you need to make sure that your computer is a Intel-based Macintosh. Then you have to go to Applications, Utilities, select Boot Camp Assistant and launch it. Once you do that, the next step will be to partition your hard drive. Now, Microsoft recommends 10 GB as the smallest reasonable and functional partition, so you might want to do that. Once the partitioning is done, you're ready to install Windows itself, so just pop in the disk and hit install. And one more thing, you want to have the partition formatted in an FAT system and not NTFS. It works better. One last tip to select which operating system you want to run. Hold down the Option key when you start off the Mac and you'll be able to see both Mac OS hard drive and Windows XP. Simply select one and hit Enter. And uh, just one more thing, don't forget to install a good antivirus. After all, you're running Windows now. Secret love, you're the one I dream of